Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I hope you found my last video helpful and I hope you're going to find this one helpful as well. Today we're going to carry on with our crochet journey and do some half travel crochets. Now, each step in crochet is a step on from the first thing. So in our last video we learned how to do some double crochets and today in this video this is the next step up. So again I have a ball of yarn and a crochet hook. Now to begin any crochet pattern we have to begin with a chain and a slip knot. So to make a slip knot loop over pull through and you have your slip knot. Insert your hook and pull through. Now I'm going to chain 10 to begin with just so that you can get to grips with this pattern. So yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Now, if you haven't got the chain yet, go back and watch my first video and get to grips with chaining and yarning over. So I'm going to do two extra chains as my turning chain. Now, in the third chain from our hook, which is this chain right here, we're going to begin with a yarn over. So just like you're going to begin to chain, you're going to yarn over and turn towards you. But you're not going to pull through this loop, you're just going to keep the yarn over on your hook. Then in the third chain from the hook, we're going to insert still with this yarn over. So now on our hook we have three stitches. We're going to yarn over again and pull through the chain. So again we have three stitches on our hook. Now to complete the half treble crochet we're going to pull through all three loops on our hook. And there we have a half treble crochet. I'm going to show you again slowly. So to begin, yarn over, but don't pull through this loop. So we have two loops on our hook. Then insert into the next chain from our hook, which is this chain right here. So now we have three stitches. Yarn over again and pull through. Then to complete our half treble, yarn over and pull through all three. Don't worry if you haven't got this yet, I'll keep going through it slowly, but just keep trying. Yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over again and pull through. So we have three loops on our hook. Yarn over one final time and this time pull through all three. I'll do a few quickly just so that you can get to see what it looks like. Now in crochet there is a half treble crochet and a treble crochet. This is the half treble as we pull through all three loops on our hook. They are two different things, so be careful in a pattern if they ask for a half treble or a treble. In my next video, I will show you how to do a treble crochet. So I have two stitches left to crochet into. So yarn over, insert your hook into the V-stitch, Yarn over again, so you have three loops on your hook. Yarn over one final time and pull through all three loops. And finally, yarn over, insert your hook, 
Yarn over and pull through. Yarn over and pull through two. So this is what one row looks like of half treble crochets. Don't worry if you haven't got this yet. Keep trying, rewind the video and go through it slowly. Remember crochet is all about practice so keep on going. So to start the next row you're going to chain two and these count as our turning chains. Now we're looking at the wrong side of the work. Now to begin the row you now don't have chains you have stitches. Each stitch is a little V and you're going to insert instead of inserting into the back loop of the V you're going to insert through both of the loops. So you have a stitch and you have a V stitch. Now, yarn over. Remember, a half treble begins with a yarn over. And insert into this V, the top V, because in this half treble we have a bottom V and we have a top V. So you make sure you insert into the top V. Yarn over again and pull through. And then yarn over and pull through all three stitches. Again, yarn over and go into the top V. Yarn over, pull through. Yarn over and pull through all three. A few more quickly, yarn over. Don't worry if you can't go quickly yet, just take your time, you will be able to do it. So again, I'm going to do a few more slowly. Yarn over, insert into the V, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through all three. Yarn over, insert into the V, yarn over, pull through, yarn over and pull through all three stitches. Now one more, yarn over, insert, yarn over, pull through, yarn over and pull through all three. This is two rows of half treble crochet. Keep on trying and you will be able to get there. Remember crochet is all about practice and this is the next step in our crochet journey. So pause the video and have a go at completing a swatch of half treble crochets. This is how mine is looking, this is my swatch of half treble crochets. So to end this swatch all I'm going to do is chain one and cut the yarn off and then to finish pull up and just tighten. So this is my swatch of half treble crochets and I hope you were able to do a similar thing at the end of this video. If you found this video helpful please give me a thumbs up and comment down below what other videos you would like to see and if you are able to crochet these stitches that I have shown you how to do. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you in a few weeks time. Bye!